Hey guys, welcome back to another vlog. So it is 5.45 on Friday, July 17th, and I am heading on a three-day trip that I'm pretty excited for. It should be a pretty good trip, and I'm excited to film it for you guys. I'm flying with Sandy once again. She was in my last video, and I love flying with her, so I know it's gonna be a good trip. We overnight tonight in Omaha, but we get in at like 11.30. Obviously, it's uh, six, so we get in super early. We have two legs. We go from here in, in Indy to Charlotte, and then Omaha today, and then tomorrow we overnight in Jacksonville, Florida. So I'm really looking forward to this trip, and I'm gonna head to the airplane. So just made it to the airplane, you know, did all my pre-flight, my safety checks, wiped down my galley, and we are about to board our flight to Charlotte, and we have about an hour there. I'm definitely going to get coffee because nothing is open in Indy right now. I'm so frustrated. I really want my coffee. I had no time to make it at home this morning, and I might make it on the airplane. That's how desperate I am right now. So, yeah, we only sit for like an hour, and... We will head to Omaha, so yeah, I will see you guys soon. So we just landed in Charlotte not too long ago, got my Starbucks finally, thank the Lord. I waited in a pretty long line, but it was worth it. I feel a little, little bit more like myself now. So we are heading to Omaha, I think it's a two hour flight, I haven't got the flight time yet, but if I had to guess. It's something along that line and we get in super early. I plan to take a nap and explore. So see y'all later. All right, so we just made it to Omaha, Nebraska and funny enough, I was here two days ago and I'm actually happy to be back. It's one of my favorite overnights and we stay downtown now. We used to stay in a hotel with a casino but we've changed and I actually like this one way better because it's by literally everything and you can walk so you don't have to Uber or uh, take any kind of transportation, so that's super nice. It is, I think it's noon. Yeah, so it's noon, and in about an hour, Sandy and I, my other flight attendant, we're gonna go kind of walk around, grab some lunch, and explore the town, so I'll show you my room. Two beds. So that's it. Right, look who it is. He's making a return. Sandy! Cameo our parents. <laughs> Alright, so we are at my all-time favorite sushi place called I almost said Crunchy LA. <laughs> Blue sushi, but I get the crunchy LA roll. There's one in Indiana, but there's also one in Omaha. So I'll show you what I'm talking about. It's literally the best. What's up guys? I just got back to my hotel from exploring Omaha and it was so much fun except it was 97 degrees. It's literally so hot outside. 
I am wiped out. I know I'm probably gonna regret this later, but I think I'm gonna take a tiny, tiny nap. I cannot stay awake right now. I am so tired, so I'm gonna do that, and I'm probably gonna make my own stuff for dinner. I brought spaghetti and a salad, so that's my plan the rest of the night. And yeah, that's about it. Good morning, guys. It is currently 4.50 in the morning. I have a couple minutes before I'm supposed to be downstairs for the van. We go from here in Omaha to Philly today and then Philly to Jacksonville. I will keep you guys updated throughout the day and yeah, I'll see you later. It's too early for this. What is up, guys? So it is actually much later than when you saw me the last time. So it is eight o'clock and we are in Jacksonville, Florida. I just got back from the beach with Sandy and we got dinner and it was so much fun. I'm glad we went down there. I will insert the clips here. It was such a good day. It was a very good three-day trip. Tomorrow is go home day, so I'm very excited for that. And yeah, I got some sun and I really miss the beach and being in Florida. It feels really good to be back. I feel like I took a mini vacation. So I'm heading to bed, like I said before I showed you guys those clips. It is eight, it's about 8.30 now and we have to get up at about 4.30 a.m. to head back to Indy. We go from here in Jacksonville to Miami, very quick 30 minute flight, and then Miami to Indy, and we'll be home for the day. So yeah, I'm gonna hit the sheets, and I will talk to you guys bright and early tomorrow morning. Before I forget, I will give you my room tour. This hotel is actually super nice. We used to stay at a not so great hotel in Jacksonville. It was by the airport. And now we are downtown on the river. So yeah, super exciting. And here's my hotel room and then I'm going to bed. You know, reality, you know, it's probably not gonna happen, but you know, I never give up hope. But at the same time, if you found it, that would suggest you knew where you were. Good morning guys. It's go home day, but it's also 4.50 in the morning. I am literally so tired, even though I think I still got like a good six or seven hours of sleep. But like I said, we go home today, we fly to Miami first, and then Miami, or yeah, Miami to Indy. So I'm gonna need some coffee to get me going and we'll be good. But yeah, very excited to go home and I'll talk to you soon. So we just made it to Miami and Sandy and I got Cuban coffee. These are espresso shots and they are very, very high in caffeine. Which I need because waking up at 4 a.m. It's just a necessity. But it's so good. We got empanadas and it's only 8 in the morning. So yeah, it's go home leg though. Feeling good, feeling caffeinated. So yeah, that's it. It's seriously so strong that I cannot like chug this. You're supposed to just like chug it, but I literally can't. It is so strong. Oh my gosh. All right, so the last time you saw me was drinking Cuban coffee in Miami, and it is actually a couple weeks later, and I just want to apologize for not getting out this video in a timely manner or really just uploading in general. Life has been very crazy. I have been working a ton and there's just a, a lot on my brain between the pandemic and possibly losing my job. In a couple months, I haven't heard word yet. Our airline really doesn't know how many flight attendants are gonna furlough. Um, I have absolutely no idea. I believe I'm right on the cusp, which makes it even more stressful because I don't know which way to prepare myself. I've been with my company for two years. 
Um, I like to think I have good seniority, but at the end of the day, I'm still very junior. So I don't know <laughs> how to feel. Um, I'm trying to come up with a backup plan, um, but that's why I have been a little absent from YouTube. There's just a lot been going on and I just want to make sure that I'm motivated and in the right headspace to film. And honestly, the flights and the overnights I have had and the trips just aren't really worth vlogging. They have been very long days and very short overnights and I've had single days off in between, which is not enough time to recuperate at home and yeah, I just wanted to apologize for for being absent on here, but I do have an Instagram and I am active on there more, so I will leave that on the screen and in my description if you want to head over and give me a follow. But I do want to say thank you for making it to the end of this video and if you are already subscribed, a huge thank you. I just hit 3,000 subscribers and I think that's literally crazy that 3,000 of you guys watch my videos and are subscribed. I appreciate each and every one of you for taking the time to watch my videos so it doesn't go unnoticed and thank you for all of your supportive comments within the last couple weeks. It really means a lot to me. Um, make sure to spread kindness, spread love. Everyone's going through it now. I mean, it's still August and we're in the middle of this stupid pandemic so I can't believe it's still happening and it's still very prevalent and now the numbers are rising in the United States again. I just, I can't believe it. it honestly feels like a huge nightmare and hopefully within the next couple weeks we will hear some good news or some positive, I don't know, but it's just, it's been a long couple months and I'm sure you guys can agree with me on that. So on that note, I am gonna end this video. Once again, thank you for watching and I will see you on my next vlog.